The fear of technical barriers often keeps us from trying new things. Connecting to IPTV is one of those things that seems complicated, but is actually very simple. Some say you need a TV box and make a long speech about the importance of choosing the right box. The fact is, they just want to sell boxes or fire sticks. If you have a smart TV, you don't need either. You can use box and countless other gadgets, but you don't have to. All you need is to watch this video and do as shown. Click on the URL below or type it into the browser on your TV. I am going to install Smarties Pro Tuner on my computer, but the operation is the same on TV. The latest models of Smarties Pro are sold. You can also choose from thousands of other players. But we talked about keeping it simple, right? That's why I suggest we use an older version of Smarties Pro because it's free, but very good. When you have put the URL in the browser on your TV, a page similar to this will appear. Find the download button, click on it, and give it time to load. After that, click Accept to launch the player. It may take a while. I already uploaded the player so I can't do it again, but when he enters, a picture opens that might be similar to this one. In any case, you will find an active link that says ADD New User. Click on it. Then this interface will open. Simple and clear, and one of the main reasons why so many people choose the Smarties Pro player is because of how simple it is to set up. You have probably purchased a subscription to our streaming service on this page already and have received an email with the information you need to activate the subscription. The mail is similar to this. Here are two long URLs that you really don't need to install. But I have colored with yellow what you need to use. First, copy username and go back to the player. In the top field, you can actually put any name. I put new TV line and then you paste username in the field of the same name. Let's go back to the email and copy a password. Two back into the player and paste it into the boxes below. Once again, we go to the email and copper them this URL. She plays a key role in all of this, and we put her in the bottom box. Then click ADD user, and your player is ready. Here, let's click on Live TV, and then a list will appear with all the countries you have access to. But to speed us up, you can go to the search bar and enter the country that you want to search for content from. For example, Iceland. Once you've entered the name of the country, close the pop-up and you'll see the country is there in the background. When you click on it, a list of the radio and television stations you have access to in the country you selected will appear. Enjoy. Close to safety because he didn't have any control of what was happening. And it's like...